O God, come to my assistance. O Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Jesus, Lord, have mercy on the soul so blessed, who in faith gone from us now in death find rest. Here mid stress and conflict, toils can never cease. There the warfare ended, bid them rest in peace. Sorely were they wounded in the deadly strife. Heal them, good physician, with a balm of life. Every taint of evil, frailty and decay, Good and gracious Savior, cleanse and purge away. The Lord will keep you from all evil. He will guard your soul. I lift up my eyes to the mountains. From where shall come my help? My help shall come from the Lord, who made heaven and earth. May he never allow you to stumble. Let him sleep not your God, nor he sleeps not nor slumbers, Israel's God. The Lord is your God and your shade, at your right side he stands. By day the sun shall not smite you, nor the moon in the night. The Lord will guard you from evil. He will guard your soul. The Lord will guard your going and coming, both now and forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. The Lord will keep you from all evil. He will guard your soul. If you kept a record of our sins, Lord, who could escape condemnation? Out of the depths I cry to you, O Lord. Lord, hear my voice. O let your ears be attentive to the voice of my pleading. If you, O Lord, should mark our guilt, Lord, who would survive? But with you is found forgiveness. For this we revere you. My soul is waiting for the Lord. I count on his word. My soul is longing for the Lord. More than watchmen for daybreak. Let the watchmen count on daybreak. And Israel on the Lord. Because with the Lord there is mercy and fullness of redemption, Israel indeed he will redeem from all its iniquity. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. If you kept a record of our sins, Lord, who could escape condemnation? 
As a father raises the dead and gives them life, so the Son gives life to whom he wills. Though he was in the form of God, Jesus did not deem equality with God something to be grasped at. Rather he emptied himself and took the form of a slave, being born in the likeness of man. He was known to be of human estate, and it was thus that he humbled himself obediently accepting even death, death on a cross. Because of this, God highly exalted him and bestowed on him the name above every other name, so that at Jesus' name every knee must bend in the heavens, on the earth, and under the earth and every tongue proclaim to the glory of God the Father. Jesus Christ is Lord. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. As a father raises the dead and gives them life, so the Son gives life to whom he wills. O death, where is your victory? O death, where is your sting? The sting of death is sin, and sin gets its sting from the law. But thanks be to God who has given us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Lord, in your steadfast love, give them eternal rest. Lord, in your steadfast love, give them eternal rest. You will come to judge the living and the dead. Give them eternal rest. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Lord, in your steadfast love, give them eternal rest. Our crucified and risen Lord has redeemed us. Alleluia. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him. In every generation, he has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things. And the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel. For he has remembered his promise of mercy. The promise he made to our fathers. To Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son. And to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Our crucified and risen Lord has redeemed us. Alleluia. O 
We acknowledge Christ the Lord, through whom we hope that our lowly bodies will be made like his in glory, and we say, Lord, you are our life and resurrection. Christ, Son of the living God, who raised up Lazarus, your friend from the dead, raise up to life and glory the dead whom you have redeemed by your precious blood. Lord, you are our life and resurrection. Christ, consoler of those who mourn, you dry the tears of the family of Lazarus, of the widow's son, and the daughter of Jairus. Comfort those who mourn for the dead. Lord, you are our life and resurrection. Christ, Savior, destroy the reign of sin in our earthly bodies, so that just as through sin we deserve punishment, so through you we may gain eternal life. Lord, you are our life and resurrection. Christ, Redeemer, look on those who have no hope because they do not know you. May they receive faith in the resurrection and in the life of the world to come. Lord, you are our life and resurrection. You revealed yourself to the blind man who begged for the light of his eyes. Show your face to the dead who are still deprived of your light. Lord, you are our life and resurrection. When at last our earthly home is dissolved, give us a home not of earthly making, but built of eternity in heaven. Lord, you are our life and resurrection. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Almighty and merciful God, may our brothers and sisters may our brothers and sisters share the victory of Christ, who loved us so much that he died and rose again to bring us new life. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. <laughs>